Hey, I'm Bernard Nomberg with the Nomberg Law Firm in Birmingham, Alabama. We're continuing our series about individuals who apply for Social Security Disability Benefits. We're discussing the different blue book listings of medical conditions, diseases, and disorders in which a person can identify with when they file for disability benefits. We're at 10.00 congenital disorders that affect multiple body systems. And this is typically dealing with Down syndrome and other related conditions. And I'm gonna go through a few of those syndromes. This is not the complete list, but it is to give you an idea of this category of 10.00. There's two different types of Down syndrome that are in this list for consideration, non-mosaic, and mosaic, and I'm not gonna get into the differences from a medical standpoint because I'm not qualified, but just to give you an idea of how they categorize these. Non-mosaic Down syndrome is a genetic disorder. Although Down syndrome exists in non-mosaic and mosaic forms, they evaluate only the non-mosaic Down syndrome under this body system for this particular analysis. Examples of these disorders includes ju juvenile and late onset forms of Tay-Sachs disease, trisomy X or Tri-X syndrome, fragile X syndrome, PKU, caudal regression syndrome, and fetal alcohol syndrome. These impact or affect multiple body parts. If you have one of these conditions or if a family member has one of these, you need to have, and you're gonna file for disability benefits, you have to have laboratory results, you have to have other medical evidence where you're being treated and having been diagnosed, and the impact on how it creates a disability. If you have questions or concerns about this or any part of the application process of applying for Social Security Disability Benefits, just give us a call. 205-930-6900 is our office number. Nomberglaw.com is our website. And subscribing to our channel will ensure that you get these videos as they come out each 